When the Israeli people entered the Promised Land, they miraculously crossed the Jordan River on dry land. To help future generations to know of the miracles God had done, Joshua created a monument with 12 stones. He knew how important it was to remember. Much of the world's culture wars against the culture we have in Christ Jesus. However, we can take a lesson from the Israeli nation. Even when the several generations lived in exile, thrown into cultures that drastically contrasted their own, they maintained their beliefs. Although Old Testament leaders such as Joseph, Daniel, Esther, and Moses were amazing at gaining influence and leadership positions within this foreign country, they never forgot who God was and what He had done in their lives. You can do the same for the next generation by sharing stories of what God has done in your life. You know, growing up, my grandparents would often talk about how they came to Christ and all that God had done for them. They shared stories of times when they didn't know where they would get the next meal for our family, but God miraculously came through. Hearing these stories built up our faith and gave us a firm foundation. In fact, we still reminisce when we get together, remembering God's goodness. Don't wait for them to ask. Get creative, create memories in the minds of the next generation so that they will never forget who God is. Matthew 28, 19 says, go and make disciples of all the nations. You can do just that by partnering with us. Because of your generous donations, people are receiving God's word in their language. Visit miraclechannel.ca to give today.